Hello friends, in this video, we are going to see about Maslow's hierarchy of needs theory or Maslow's pyramid of motivation. Abraham Maslow was an American psychologist, was studying the needs of people and he derived this pyramid as a hierarchy of needs. In his first proposed theory, there were only five domains like this, which can be further classified into the basic or the fundamental needs, the psychological or the needs related to the psychology and the self-fulfillment or the needs which is going to satisfy the purpose of our life. Again, the basic needs can be further classified into biological or physiological needs and this include food, sleep, water, air, shelter, sex, etc. If we climb one step above the pyramid, we go to the safety needs where we look at the security, health, finances, law and order, insurance, social stability, etc. If the layers present below are ensured, then people start moving or climb up the pyramid and focus on the needs which is above. If these basic needs are ensured, then they move on to the love and belonging needs where their needs will be focused on their friendship, intimacy, family, connections, trust, affection, etc. Then if this is ensured, then people move on to the esteem needs, which is oriented towards the respect, status, recognition in the society, strength of the individuals and also self-esteem. Then if this is ensured, then people focus towards the self-actualization, which means they understand what is their full potential and they think about the purpose of their life and they focus on the growth of the individual. They become creative with good moral values. If they reach at this point, that is the self-actualization level of needs. Usually, as the age increases, people move upwards in this pyramid and also as they become rich, if all the basic needs are ensured, then also they climb above so that they can focus on the needs towards self-actualization. As I told earlier, this was the five domains of needs originally proposed by Maslow, but later, after 15 years, he himself modified and added three more needs into it so that the domains became eight. The base in that pyramid is physiological needs, above which same is the safety needs, above which love and belonging needs, above which the esteem needs and between self-actualization and esteem needs, we have cognitive needs where the needs related to the knowledge and aesthetic needs are the needs related to the appearance of individuals. If self-actualization is focused on individual themselves, transcendence is a stage where individuals think about mystical experiences like they want to conserve nature or they will be oriented to towards some political ideology or some religion or the service to the humanity for a particular cause or explore something in science. So when they attain for an ideology, then that is called as the transcendence stage or transcendent needs. So we humans are at some stage focusing on these needs at different levels with different intensity. Thanks for watching this video.